don't be jealous. It's not everybody that can wake up in the morning and look this good. When you got it, you got it. Because I love you guys, I'm out here in the garage. I'm gonna work on the holy water font. I'm gonna use the crucifix that I got from Free Cycle uh, a couple of weeks ago, and the pie tin that I got uh, just the other day. I'm gonna combine them to make the font. I think if I mount it on some wood, I think it'll actually work out pretty well. It'd be too easy just to take the crucifix, the tin, mount them on top of each on this piece of wood and call it a day. That wouldn't look good, right? Nah. <laughs> we gotta do uh, something a little bit more creative than that. So what I wanna do is actually cut ba the basic design around the crucifix here and then cut that out and that way it just looks like this is hanging on the wall even though it's, it's gonna be mounted onto the uh, wood. So I'll just be able to drill like a screw in here and it's got a screw mount up here plus the two holes that I drilled yesterday. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to outline the uh, crucifix and then uh, <clears throat> use my jigsaw to uh, cut it out. Actually think that looks pretty good. I think that uh, it's gonna work. This will get mounted here. That will get mounted there. Oh, all right. Let's go inside and I can show you. So I'm gonna be giving this wood just a quick uh, stain. It's gonna be nothing special. The crucifix is mostly going to hide hide the wood. And where it shows through, as I said, I think it'll help highlight uh, the, the brass. Might be a very quick project. I'll let this soak into the wood for a minute. And I'll be back and wipe it off. You know, a little bit darker because now it kind of like blends in but another coat or two and it should be uh, good. All right I think that uh, looks pretty good like that. So what I do is drill a couple of holes. I'm gonna we got a hole already here and then the two that I put in the uh, plate I got these uh, screws I found they have like a copper brass head on them so maybe it'll blend in a little bit with the uh, the pieces here I think 
that's a, uh, a decent holy water bowl. Although I might actually screwing this to the wall, maybe like right through here, this space here, only because I don't want someone pulling this off the wall. Just a quick project today. I think that's a good one to knock out. If you like what you see, give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. You get videos like this where I'm working every day on putting together Halloween props. And let me know in the comments section below. I haven't heard from very many of you yet, but let me know in the comments section below if I should do a stained glass uh, effect on the windows. Okay, thanks for watching. Because I love you guys, I'm out here in the garage and I'm working on the hall. Because I love you guys, I'm out here in the garage and I'm going to work on the holy water font. So I'm going to get some wood now and then here we go. And here we go. Now it's going to work out good.